Hi, welcome back to Chem with Go. Today we're going to take a look at half-life again, uh, and but this time we're going to try to do the calculation in a little bit of an easier way instead of having to use logarithms and uh, exponential notation um, to solve for uh, these problems. Now, obviously the numbers are going to work out uh, in an easy way, or they need to work out in an easy way. Um, otherwise, we won't be able to actually get the answer uh, without using logs uh, to solve for it. But um, let me go ahead and set up the problem. The half-life of polonium-218 is about three minutes. Okay, And if we actually had 16 grams to start out with, what we're trying to do is find out how many minutes is it going to take in order for this uh, substance to decompose to only one gram left. Now let's define the half-life. The half-life is the amount of time it takes for half of a uh, radioactive substance to decay to one half of its original substance. So really what we're going to do here is just count how many times we divide by 2 and multiply that times the half-life. So again, if we start out with 16 grams, what we're going to do is we're going to divide this by 2 and keep dividing it by 2 until we get to 1 gram. And we're just going to count how many times we do that. So let's start that on the next page. So let's start out 16 grams. Let's divide that by 2. We get 8. We divide that by 2 again. We get 4 grams. Divide that by 2 again. We get 2 grams. And then one final time, we get 1 gram, which is what we were trying to get. Now, if we count the number of arrows, look, here's 1, 2, 3, and 4. There's four arrows. That means there's actually four half-lives that have occurred. Well, if each half-life is three minutes, and there were four half-lives that occurred, each one being three minutes, then really all we have to do is multiply the number of half-lives times the actual half-life itself. So four times three minutes it gives us 12 minutes. And that's our final answer. And what that does, again, what it explains is this. If I had a 16 gram sample and uh, the half-life of polonium 218 is 3 minutes, how long does it take to get to 1 gram? How long does the sample uh, take to decompose so only 1 gram of the polonium 218 actually is in existence? And it would be 12 minutes. All right, and that's it for today. I'll see you in class.